from beautiful sarongs bearing breathtaking batik motifs, elaborate murut headhunters blowpipes, precision bajau parangs, unique coconut-shaped handbags to intricate tapestry designs, Sabah has plenty to offer to the world. Home to 42 ethnic groups and 200 sub-ethnic groups, Sabah's amazing diversity has created a blend of arts and crafts that is truly unique. These products are now finding a world market online and it's fast becoming a multi-million ringgit industry. In a recent working visit organised by Malaysia Convention and Exhibition Bureau, Tourism Minister Nancy Shukri said foreigners were snapping up Sabah craft work online. Noting that the demand has created a need for more local craft entrepreneurs, she said her ministry is offering certificate and diploma level programs to Sabah youths wishing to take up the trade. Let's take a look at some of the Sabah crafts that are in demand today. Sabahans take pride in creating various locally inspired tapestry designs such as Dasta, Muga, Ampik, Pis and Sambitan. Tapestry weaver Hasila Siratirao Handa told FMT that the ideas for such designs, which are based on flora and fauna in Sabah's indigenous ecosystem, are reflected in the floral motifs like the lotus flower, cotton flower and wax cord flower. She said the tapestry products, usually the choice fabric for weddings, wall decor or table furnishing, could take weavers several days to complete by hand just a few metres. To create the leaf origami, pandan and coconut leaves are first processed and then turned into flexible straws and woven into hats, food wrappers, mats, baskets and other household items. The ideal basket for fishing is made from bamboo. It is also used to make musical instruments, mats, storage chests and trays. A prized craft, Sabah offers pencil cases, hats, wooden boxes and handbags made from their tree bark. You can even find tree bark jackets and hats mostly during wedding ceremonies. Rattan, an easily available commodity in Borneo, is a favourite material used for weaving in Sabah. All the different ethnic groups use rattan in producing bags, traditional hats, baskets and mats, among others. Women who are skilled in beadwork, the traditional handicraft of Borneo, design varying patterns, colours and motifs to indicate their social status and identity. Most of the designs are inspired by nature. Sabahan's batik patterns, which are inspired by nature, showcase leaves, geometric patterns, animals and flowers. Dunduang, a food cover in bright colours of yellow, pink and blue, is mostly made using dried serdang leaves which resemble those of palms found in swampy areas. It takes anywhere between 1 to 3 days to complete one dinduang. Brass and bronze are traditionally used by Sabahans to produce other forms of metal craft, such as jewellery, sculptures, utensils and musical instruments which are in high demand. If you want a small piece of Sabah to wear or have as memorabilia, do check out the diverse range of handcrafted products that are available on the Tourism Ministry's eBazaar site at www.mycraftshop.com.